If you own a car that's 20 years or younger, the chances are the clamp on your battery is one of these stupid little thin things, which personally I don't like. That being said, the modern battery only lasts three to five years max, so there's a fair chance your next battery may not be exactly the same with regards to the thickness of the terminal posts. And therein lies the problem. Now you need a nice firm connection with your battery, but I've found in those circumstances that it's not always the case, and you end up with a very bad sloppy connection. So here's my little hack that I recently did. So I've put the battery back in the 350Z out of the Land Cruiser and I modified it. Well, actually it took me an hour to put all the clips and mount the battery back, which is a real pain. But these have those stupid, tiny, thin little battery connectors. And they were really loose, which you should never have in a battery. So I modified it. I had some old lead strips from my uncle's place and I put inside if you can see so if you can see inside of those terminals I've put a thin lead strip which I cut and wrapped around the post so squish those right in there which is a hell of a lot better believe me yeah <laughs> uh, something productive I did on my car now, if you don't happen to have any old lead sheet lying around, which most people probably wouldn't, I'd suggest the substitute of perhaps a thin bit of copper sheet or even a thin one millimetre thick sheet of aluminium because both will still be pliable enough to do this modification. I hope that little tip helps you out. Cheers, and I'll see you soon. Bye. If you're new to this channel and would like to see my new videos, click subscribe and the little bell next to it and you'll get an email the moment they're out.